first install the virtual env and activate it so python virtual environment let's go ahead and check if you already have python installed so python go ahead and launch your command prompt and type python space hyphen uppercase v and if you've got python installed on your system you should see you've got python and then the version of the python that you have on your system i've got python 3.8 which is latest version of python i also have pip installed with it so anything above python 3.x whatever python 3 and above whatever you install have installed you already have pip installed and it's there on your system so make sure you already have python installed if you have not installed and you want to install it right away go ahead and watch my previous video where i have shown how to install python and set it to the path as well so once that's done let's go ahead and launch the command prompt and quickly install the virtual environment activate it so go ahead and type this command pip sorry not php pip install virtual env and hit enter this is going to already satisfy so virtual environment is already there on my system but you will have to install it if you haven't installed it previously ever so I already have pip uh, sorry virtual environment installed I can go ahead and list it so you can see I've got virtual environment 16.7.8 which is the latest version of virtual environment now let's go ahead and clear the screen and create a virtual environment so I'm going to create a virtual environment named test env within this uh, particular folder that's user so anything that we are going to do here it will go under this folder so this is basically the user on the system and here we are going to create a virtual environment okay so let's go ahead and do that so you simply type v and v basically you'll have to type like this pi hyphen m when and the name of the of the uh, virtual environment test environment so let's go ahead and say test env but this is completely optional you can name it whatever you want it to now i'm going to hit enter and this is going to create test env folder within this particular folder so tube meant that the folder that's the username basically now this is taking a bit longer on my system okay so it's been created now if i go ahead and check it you can see it has already created test env so now we need to activate it so let's go ahead and activate so to activate it you need to get into that particular folder so you'll simply say test env so it's not working basically you simply say like this test env and then you have to say script scripts and then activate so it's very simple name of the virtual environment so that in my case it's test env and then scripts this is like you have to type it after the name of the virtual environment you have to type scripts then you simply type activate and this is going to be activated once you hit enter so once you have got the virtual environment name here in the braces before this c column user and the username you are in that particular virtual environment and it's been activated 